Are you guys ready for a lesson in uh, fucking logic, guys? Hello, class. Today, today I want to introduce an idea, and Mike Wang didn't, he didn't follow me back on Twitter, or he didn't text me, he didn't email me, but I had a really good idea. So let's talk about it. Hi guys, my presentation today is on proximity chat. Proximity chat is when you're in a game and you can voice chat with people near you. <laughs> now that right there is a good idea. The closer you get to your opponents, the louder you are. Does that make sense? So I can't click a button and talk to you from across the map, but if you happen to be standing right there, me and you could communicate. Can I help demonstrate, sir? Come on, come on, class. Okay. Hi, How are you doing? What's I'm your name? Hi, Mr. Agent. I'm Malid. It's nice to meet you. I've never seen you in this class before. I, I'm just a big, I'm a big fan. Okay, nice. So, proximity chat would be if me and Waleed were able to speak now, but now we can't hear each other as loud because we're further apart. But if I sent Waleed out the fucking room, I wouldn't be able to hear him at all. You guys understand? All right. I found this very funny video I want to share with the class, so let's watch. Alright, uh, uh, Uber Uber here, uh, coming, back coming back to the, to the uh, day, day in the uh, blue uh, dot. Yeah. Uh, hey, 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 how you going? Uh, how are you, how you going? going? Did you, uh, did you, uh, did you sort did everything, everything out you needed to here for, for, for the day, sir? Uh, yes, got two kills, and my mate is dead. <laughs> Excuse me, do we hear the video? Class, you guys can stop talking amongst yourselves. Oh, uh, there's a guy to your uh, uh, left there. there. I don't know who he is or what, or what he's looking at. So he can't, so he see, can't us. see us. Um, uh, okay, uh, okay, so, so uh, where, would, where you like would you like to be like delivered, to be delivered today, today, sir? Uh, take us to Gatka, eh? Uh, uh, certainly, certainly, sir. No, no worries. worries. Just gonna, Just gonna, uh, gonna, gonna do, do a little, little three, three point, point turn here. here. Uh, I like my, uh, Grandpa talking back, back in the day, day, day um, um, and then and we're off. Okay, did you guys see that video? Hilarious, right? But without proximity chat, those players would have never been able to communicate with one another. Do you see what I'm talking about now? Proximity chat opens you up to this whole new world of opportunities, not just for content creators, but when you're playing the game itself. You see what I'm saying? All right, so let's get into the meat of this presentation. Uh, our friends, my close friends, I know these guys since I was like five years old at the University of Melbourne, these three professors had nothing better to do than to study proximity chat. So they put out this study, I'm not gonna lie to you bro, anytime I see a study, I just skip to the conclusion. I don't wanna see the bullshit, I just wanna see what you found out. And they found out some shit, all right? So I'm gonna leave the link right here in case you guys have nothing to do with your time. And if you do have nothing to do, watch some more of my videos. But in case you don't wanna do that, I will leave the link in the description. Do you guys have any questions? Games Radar covered that article and they talked a lot about proximity chat as well because they see it as being the future of gaming. What a small, incredibly tiny feature that makes such a gargantuous difference. The first time I played proximity chat was in SOCOM Confrontation. Now, we're gonna do a visualizing session, all right, before we talk about the details of that study. Imagine you're in the playground, right? And once you get into the playground, let's say you're walking around and instead of just walking by people you can't talk to unless they're in your squad and turn their mic on, let's say they have their mic on. You could communicate by just walking close to the other individual. I've never been in no fucking neighborhood in my entire life, believe it or not guys, this is crazy. I've never been in a neighborhood where I cannot talk to the people around me. <laughs> wow. So not only in 18 did they add a neighborhood, but then they took out the ability, <laughs> the ability to talk to the other team in the game. So it's like you're in a neighborhood, but you can't talk to nobody. I'd lose my mind if I was in that neighborhood because I talk to my neighbors all the time with proximity chat. I can't talk to them from across the community, but if they're right beside me, I'd say hi. Do you get where I'm going with this? Let's say that you're a YouTuber. You don't even have to be a YouTuber. Let's use an everyday example. Let's say that I'm in the park. I load in. I'm going to my mic court, chilling, right? And the guy at the door, he's a user player, but he has proximity chat on and he's like, yo, you want to play a game on the mic court? You guys add each other, boom, you've just made a friend because of proximity chat. 
You see what I'm saying? PUBG does this, Sea of Thieves does this, Friday the 13th does this, SOCOM Confrontation back in the day did this. This is not nothing new. People have been doing proximity chat more and more in recent years. And I don't know any game where it integrates better than NBA 2K. Because you're trying to create that social translucence, like you can really talk to everybody. This immersive experience. Do you see what I'm saying, Mike? This is why I wanted to talk to you, bro. This is why I wanted to talk to you. You guys have any questions? In the article, I took a quote. I'm not stealing, they did this. That's why I put quotations. The chat system created an environment of social translucence. You heard that here first. You can, you can read that article if you want to. Willie, come up here. I want you to look at the class and tell them what the f proximity chat is in 10 seconds. See if you're listening. Hello. Bitch. Um, <clears throat> so if, if your 10 seconds are up, <laughs> this can fail the class, bro. Get him out. Get him, out, get him out of this classroom. <laughs> Waste of time. Do you guys see where I'm going with this idea? Do you see the brilliance now? Is it clicking for you guys? You walk in a f***ing neighborhood of people you can't talk to, and it's supposed to be this immersive experience? No, it looks stale. I'm not going into no NBA 2K zone to play some garbage mini basketball. I can do this shit at Chuck E. Cheese, all right? I'm, I'm playing 2K. So some of you guys hate good ideas, and I recognize that. All right, some of you guys like to see the problem in any new ideas for a change, so I got solutions for you guys. Do you see this? Agent, what if there's a toxic individual with a garbage mic? What if, what if there's a toxic individual and he's trolling you, right? It happens. You're on the internet, bitch. Believe it or not, you're not going to be immune to that shit. How about an option to be immune? <laughs> oh, what a fucking thought of that, ladies and gentlemen. Not Ronnie. I did. An option to mute, ladies and gentlemen. It makes all the sense in the world. If someone's trolling you, you can mute them in two seconds done with it. Okay, so what are the downsides? I'll wait. Can you guys respond to me and tell me the downsides of this idea? I just see brilliance. When I walk in PUBG, I'm talking shit to everybody until I get in the game. And I'm ass at that game. Could you imagine if I did it in 2K and I'm great at that game? Can you imagine the type of shit I'd be able to talk? The type of friends I'd be able to make? The type of challenges and fun videos? The type of enjoyment I'll be able to have in this immersive... I'm sorry class, I have anger issues. And this immersive experience, grab to the channel. That was the last one. Shout out to Ronnie 2 okay. Dude is a giant in real life. You guys remember, he's like six foot four, bro. crazy. That's it, y'all. That's all I wanted to tell y'all. Mike Wang, my emails are open. You can DM me, I'm following you. You can text me, I'll give you my number. I'll just tweet it out, actually. But only Mike Wang, and I only want Mike Wang to hit me up. Ladies and gentlemen, drop a like, subscribe to the channel. I'm dropping jams in this bitch. I've never heard anybody bring up Proximity Chapter 2K, but it's the one game where it makes the most sense. How are we not gonna add it in? And let's not pretend like it's a fucking complicated feature to introduce. Everybody has mics, it's 2018. Now some of y'all got garbage ass mics. Mute that mic, nobody's trying to talk to you on Proximity Chat. But for the other people who have good mics, who wanna play and have more fun, for those people, ladies and gentlemen, those people want Proximity Chat in the game. Thank you.